Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Um, I just made it to my stop. And so I'm gonna go ahead. I don't know why I'm starting this video so abruptly, but um, long story short, I am in Georgia and I'm on my way to Arkansas. And so I'm just, you know, picking up my load. Right now, I'm just trying to finish writing down all my info. This morning wasn't that seamless. I <laughs> went to the wrong location because I had in my mind that I was supposed to be picking up the same place that I dropped off at last night. Ended up not being that way. Also, Georgia doesn't have but like two truck stops and I parked at the pilot truck stop, except even though I was bobtail, I didn't have any room, so I was doing the absolute most. I ended up waking up and pulling off without checking my drive time and I actually didn't have any drive time left. Very stupid move. Obviously, I was rushing because I normally would, you know, press inspection and da 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 da. Because I didn't have a trailer, I just walked around my truck and kept it moving. Girl or child, I I I was I was not I had to call logs and get them to fix the issue. And like I said, I never finished writing down all my info before I pulled up here. So what I normally like to do is write down my actual trip number. Obviously, I did write down the pickup number so that I can actually get the load. But I also like to write down the addresses. I'm going to be dropping off at two different spots. They have me where I'm doing stops, which is interesting this would be my first time with this company doing stops um and i'm honestly i'm not mad at that so my first stop is sam's club second stop is Walmart and they both need to be dropped off by nine o'clock tonight but as y'all know I'm not about to be driving out here all day I'm gonna be done way before then um, I'm about 480 miles away from both stops so that means and being that they're both in the same city that means that I'm clearly going to make it there before the end of the day. Is this stop number one or stop number two? My tablet lost. This is Being that this is my first time receiving this type of load, it's, it's a tad bit confusing. <whistles> Reading this because they sent it separately, it's real weird. Like, I don't, I don't understand it. Like which stop is first so the first the first trip sheet says that uh, I might have to call them because it, it doesn't show exactly where I'm supposed to go first
okay so i'm stupid not really but yes a little bit um technically because it's sam's club and it's walmart it says it's different stops but they're the same address so i just called them like hey which address do i go to first and they're like it's one address like oh okay got you so it's just set up a tad bit different i don't know what's up with me this morning i'm being a tad bit dingy um so now i'm just trying to put this address into my gps um of course i'm about to check satellite just make sure everything is good and we should be on our way i do have to pull out of this dock and close this door and i'm gonna set my tandems but while i'm in here let's go ahead and get this out the way i did already send my um, bill of lading info through the people net because um don't want to forget to do that And being that it's Arkansas, if I'm not mistaken, that means that it should be central time. So that means that I have like an hour ahead. My trainer at Warner, she had her GPS up here. And I'm so glad she showed me to put my GPS up here because it's just such a better like area to have your GPS instead of like down here or something. Cause like if I'm driving, all I gotta do is look to my left. I don't think I would have thought to put it there cause it's so high up but it makes perfect sense. I also need to get like a different camera holder. I don't like when I talk with this on my neck. Mess. You potty? <gasps> Mama, potty on 
found a puppy pet. Let me show you. Good girl, mama. Is you potty? What is this on your head? Let me get this off you. Let me see. What's this? It's your toy. Whatever. You potty, mama? I'll give you a treat. Hold on, y'all. I can't do three things at once. Oh, where is your treat? I'll give you a treat, mama. You potty? You potty? You potty, mama? Yep. You potty? Here. Yeah. Good girl. Good girl, mamas. Okay. I gotta put my stuff away. Pepper. I gotta clean this up. You got too much going on in here. Jesus. <sighs> Hi, mamas. You've been doing so well. Oh, yeah. Oh, Lord. Y'all, I'm out here trying to post this video, but I have terrible reception. I took my laptop into the shower with me just so that I could use my personal hotspot. You look at my feet. You look at my feet, baby. Come here. Come on. Mamas? Pepper? What are you doing, girl? You play with your toy? Oh. <laughs> what is this on your head? I want to get this off you so bad. It keep getting back on you. You want to bite and play? Bite and play? Get it, girl. Get it, mamas. Get it, mamas. 
Get it, mamas. I just made it to the shipper and now we're about to go and drop off this empty and pick up my actual trailer and we in Mississippi right now they are so country over here it's hilarious I love them <laughs> I don't even know them and I love them it just feels like so homey over here so since we already in the yard I'm gonna go ahead and record while I'm driving we can go ahead and find a um a um parking spot and it's very simple over this way y'all i actually okay so let me tell you i was struggling to get here normally for the most part i never really have an issue with gps like of course you know the trip planning and all that stuff gps is like my basic thing like it normally gets me to the places and stuff like that after gps i use you know google google um satellite and all that stuff just to confirm where the truck entrances are because i'm dedicated i normally go to the same spots but this time around this is my first time ever running into this problem i went to put in the address of this location and this address didn't pop up in my phone gps in my actual gps nowhere and when i tell you i was super confused like how the only area where it popped up was on google so i was trying to because the thing is i'm not trying to run my phone on google all day and google not gonna give you like the right routes 100 percent So I was like struggling trying to find the right routes and I don't have a map in here. So what I ended up doing was I was looking for places around the location. And when I tell you the first three places that I looked up, they didn't even have the address showing, which was so confusing. Like the address wasn't pulling up for none of those places. I was so confused. So I did eventually find this, this um, Shell gas station and the, sh the shell gas station pulled up thank god i feel like i'm not gonna make it oh i made it it's such a tight spot the shell gas station pulled up thank god so i use gps to get me to this shell gas station and the worst part is on my phone it pulled up but it didn't pull up on my um on my actual Pepper, what you doing i let her out since we in the parking lot i'm not near nobody i don't feel like it's a big deal but um by the way pepper is practically potty trained okay thank god for pepper she's such a good baby i'm not as concerned like of course she since us being on the truck this week, she made one, two accidents. And both those accidents were okay. I think I messed up this one. Look, 
but I had to memorize what streets to take once I made it to the um, gas station that wasn't for trucks, by the way. You having fun, Mama? Come here, baby. Come here, baby. You wanna come to Mama? Come here, Mama. Hold on. She confused. She like, what you wanna do? I got ADHD. I'm out here trying to. <laughs> not really. I don't wanna claim that, but I'm out here trying to not only. I'm also trying to go on my 30 minutes. I might as well just go on my 30 minute break right now since should I? I should wait until I actually park into my actual trailer. Right? Yeah. What am I doing? Come here, baby. Hi, mamas. You want to go with me? Want to go with me, baby? She be so hyper. What's up? What's up, mamas? Y'all be seeing the, the calm version of her? She goes crazy. She be out here scratching me up, playing around, jumping around. She be running around here like doggone Tasmanian devil. Oh, she jumping up here right now. What's up, baby? somewhere around the truck so I have to go and find my gloves 
every single time. So I'm gonna have to keep those away from her as well. Here goes my trailer. Dope. because she was just trying to get used to everything but now when I drive even when it's like a big bump I'll be like oh I hope she okay like as far as not being scared I go and look and she be knocked out she be chilling she do not care I'm telling you I prayed before I got pepper because I didn't want to have a dog that wouldn't like being on this truck so I prayed to God I said God please if, if I'm not meant for Pepper, don't let me get her because I don't want her to feel, you know, inconvenienced being in this truck. And I, I want for her to, I also pray for an easier time, you know, being that it's my first time driving with a dog, my first time with a dog, period. And Pepper is just A1. Come here, mamas. And she's my sweet baby. Come here, baby. Right now she's in a cuddle mood. Every time y'all catch her, she's in a cuddle mood. Where she really just wants to be up under mamas. You want some water? Let me get you some water. You want some water peps? You want some water peps? She just wanna be next to mama. Hi, baby. She's such a mild-mannered baby until she's ready to play. Like if I start putting a toy in her face, like even right now you can tell like she really just wants to go exploring. Go ahead, Mama. See, she's trying to bite my hands now. But um, I'm going to go ahead and put myself on 30 minutes. Wasn't I already on 30 minutes? Hold on. I shouldn't even put my... I was already on 30 minutes. I don't know why I'd be... I went on 30 minutes too too early though so I technically only show to have four hours left but I have six hours <laughs> excuse me I'm sorry baby I scared her a little bit but um man my attention span is so small I don't even know what I was saying or doing want some water obviously that's what that is you want some water you saw me get some water and you said skip that huh i'll get you some water want some water mamas you still got a little left but you spilled something in here it's like a fuzzy in here you put a fuzzy in your water baby i get you son i already know i already know mama already know Here, baby. Look. You was faking the whole time? Okay. While Pepper is eating, I'm going to grab me something to eat. Something small because I can't. Man, if y'all saw all my mess over here, it's a mess. It's a mess in here.
got a granola bar. Ooh, no, it's fruit in there already. Um, okay, that's just gonna hold me over until I stop for the day because I'm gonna definitely stop. Let me check on this video and see just how far we've gotten. Please, Lord. Okay, we're at, that's way further than I thought. We're at 74%, and last time I checked this, we were at 49%. That means we're going, my bad. That means we are going on strong. So, prayerfully, we can get this video up by the end of the day. Because it is 3 o'clock Central Time, which means that it's 4 o'clock Eastern. Jesus, please, we got this. Cause I really want to stay on point. I would, I haven't even posted like a community post of saying like, "Hey guys, we're posting at 6 p.m. today," like I normally would. But this morning, when I tell you, I had stopped. I, I started uploading last night. When I woke up, it was only on 19% because I was in such a dead zone. And I'm using personal hotspot for those who don't know. So I've been trying to update, upload this video the entire time. And thankfully, I got into a better area, you know, and I've been driving in a better area, but I got T-Mobile, y'all. And T-Mobile is not the best. So now we're just trying to get this uploaded by the end of the day. I can't, I, I still can't predict when, I can't predict when this video is going to drop, but I can assume that it'll be around maybe eight, nine-ish, depending on where I'm going to be at. But that surprised me. We only got 25% more to do. We getting there, we getting somewhere. Yeah, I see you. You going crazy, ain't you? Nope, don't you touch that. Hi, mamas. about to fix me something to eat I'm hungry so also I'm letting pepper roam around for a minute just to give her some time to play so they just took away my pre-plan load which I'm actually sort of happy about because I had to do a um, live load for that and Ain't no telling how long that's gonna be. Loads can tend to be like hours long, depending on the place, how many people work in, if they are fast workers, or just, honestly, it's up to chance. I've been at a place for like five hours once, waiting on them to load. Sometimes it'll even be just how long it takes for them to get to my truck before it's how long they actually start loading it. It could probably take like two minutes to finally load my truck, like 20 minutes to load my truck, but it'll have taken three hours for them to finally get to my load to start working on it, so. Live loads, live unloads, they're not my favorite unless I'm chilling. But right now, I only have like 25 miles left, or I'm sorry, uh, 25 hours left on my clock so I should be going home relatively soon I don't want to be doing a live unload wasting my month my time on my clock so. okay we got good news it is five o'clock eastern time I'm sorry central time which means that it's six o'clock eastern time and we are at 96 percent upload which is actually something that I did not expect so that means that I have about, what, I would say probably at the most an hour from now. It says 49 minutes, but I don't know. I can't really judge it. But that being said, the video should be popping up very soon. I know you guys will have already seen it by the time I actually upload it. But I'm just so happy because I was thinking that it wasn't going to post until like, um, what, 9 o'clock? But it's looking like it's going to be able to upload relatively soon so as soon as i see that it's uploaded i am going to um make it public what am i looking for i am looking for my oh i was looking for this so that i don't have to hold you 
Hold on. Okay, Pepper um scratched me a bunch of times. You heard me, mamas? Hi, big girl. Ah, uh, she's just so cute. Come here, baby girl. Look at them. You're just so pretty. You're just so pretty, mamas. Oh, the mama. You're just so pretty, big girl. Yes, I'm talking about you. Wanna get down? Okay, I'll get you down. Here, baby. Okay, one thing that I recognize that Pepper absolutely loves is, I'm about to show you right now, bully sticks. So I don't know if it looks like it might be reversed, but it's bully sticks. She absolutely loves these. Um, I got them from Walmart. They're, I got them in a size small. This is the one she's been chewing on so far. Um, it looks gross. It looks absolutely gross. But she has been chewing on it for like, what? I want to say since Sunday. And right now it's Wednesday. Um, I have four more in their bag over here. Which also, I guess I'll show you this. Right now, the truck is a mess and so is my feet. I did not do them, nor have I done my hands. Ever since I got Pepper, I've been like behind. But um, this is actually where her a lot of her stuff is for anyone who is questioning. That's her bed, but not her, it's the, it's the cushion of her bed. Her bed is actually right here. She loves chewing on these microfiber little microfiber towels so i just leave them out um honestly this is her whole playground like this is no longer me but um i just have all of her stuff in here my mom got this for me it's actually supposed to be for cars so it didn't fit around my seat but i put a bungee cord up here and it doesn't bother me from the other side my jacket's just sitting here um pepper what you doing mamas what you doing baby Hi, mommy. Hi, Pepper. Oh, you heard me. You heard me. You said, that's my name. Please don't look at my feet, y'all. So, um, all of her stuff, I have her bags. I have her dental sticks and all that stuff. Uh, her bully sticks here and everything. And this is her spray, her brush, and her eardrops. And then I have majority of her items that i use daily is actually in her passenger seat this is something she's going to eventually sit in but for now i am just keeping her stuff in it and she sits in this and she like literally chills out in this i can take her out and she'll still play around in this i don't have anything besides this trash can but i monitor it so she doesn't get in it but i don't have anything else on the floor that um, I'm concerned about her getting to the only thing sometimes is she might get to my cords over here But I watch her when she's out. So I'm not concerned Everything else is hers. Okay, and then these cords here, but this was actually on the bed. It fell just recently But um, oops everything else is hers Everything else is either hers or is something that I'm just not concerned about and she doesn't use the bathroom on my floor anymore Not even on my rug she goes to the puppy pad every single time. So please excuse the mess because I don't know. I haven't been able to keep my truck as tidy with her. Can't lie because every time I tidy up her toys, then I let her out and she wants to play with them. So, you know, don't want to just keep them away from her because then what was the point of keeping, of buying them for her? So one thing she actually likes is... um this this thing here she likes to chew on it her teeth aren't that strong so this isn't something that she's like dislodging and breaking apart um she likes the sound of it like she hears it now and now she wants to hear baby i monitor her if there's something that wasn't originally for her i do monitor it and make sure like if it's something that could eventually break down i um I will take it from her but right now everything's good she's been okay she's been playing and striving right now she looks like yep i was just about to say it looks like she's starting to turn into 
the she-hawk she goes from being calm and collected to becoming this Tasmanian devil she starts chewing on stuff and going crazy but it's like she's playing that's what she does she like chews on stuff and she like rips it like this and if I give her her toys she'll do the same thing I'll show y'all later but I'm talking I'm about to make me something to eat and then we're gonna go driving because I'm not done driving Now, this is probably a short vlog but I got a lot I have to do right now and I'm about to go ahead and change it to my pajamas me and Pepper are about to chill out we've been playing she's been running around this mug like crazy what you running for what you want to do what you want to do oh you ran into my leg Pepper huh let's say goodbye come here baby <laughs> what's that on you girl you just getting into some everything but um she's very hyper right now so i probably couldn't shouldn't hold her this long but uh by the way um i might have to cut her nails because she is definitely putting holes in all of my shirts every time i pick her up she like cl clings onto them and she tears them um but anyways uh i'm about to go ahead 
make me some tea try to finish these videos get them banging for more for the month of may um i'm about to go ahead uh, go to the restroom and all that stuff and i just want to go ahead and close out this video here so i hope you guys enjoy and i love you all so much me and pepper say bye and we will see you in the next video bye say bye pepper bye she want to go run go ahead baby go ahead go ahead all right bye y'all